a research program for initiative of excellence in innovative training. Uh, this project led by Gisène Azema provides funding for universities to share expertise in the field of digital humanities. Today we are here in Malta for a workshop labs in which three groups of students are committed to the creation of digital prototypes. The prototype should be the hypermedia, informational, game-oriented, even artistic. In all cases, they should deeply interact with both the history and the geography of the island. We consider that the possibilities provided by the technologies are meaningful when they encounter the physical reality. Not that the digital reality isn't real. It is very real. And because of that, it would be a disaster for it to grow separated from the physical and body scale reality. This is the reason why this workshop is split in two weeks between in two different cities each with its separated reality. Um, during the first week, students were working on the district of chambéry luo a typical French housing plan from the early 70s with a really rigorous and functional architecture. During the second week here in Valletta, students have to re-implement the work they did from chambéry luo to a very different place. One with a very old history, a patchwork of uh, different cultures. This particular in-situ methodology is used so that students learn not to transpose a generic technological solution in every place, but to adapt it to, to bound it to a particular place. The goal here is to underline that meaning arises extracting specificities out of a given territory, be it similar or contrasted. This kind of approach opens a new, a new field of concrete propositions where technology is not just a seducing tool, but an instrument of thought. Thank <laughs> you.